you are someone who spends all of your time focusing on other people on the internet, making fun of them, bringing them down, and calling them lol cows, if this is your source of entertainment in your life, you should look in the mirror because there's a bigger lol cow standing in your house right now. It's you. You're a loser. Very nice. Um, also coming up in July, a special React event. I'm going to start planning it soon. It's going to be a day of machinima. What do I mean by that? Well, June the King, the person who I've been watching documentaries of over the last year, they, you know, he's a documentary maker on YouTube, made a documentary about machinima. It's about 50 minutes long, and apparently it covers all the ups and downs of this company that used to be one of the biggest partnership companies on YouTube and how they literally burned themselves to the ground. I was a partner with them for six years. I held out while most other YouTubers who were with them jumped ship. I stayed with them for the maximum amount of time that I could, and man, did I experience a bunch of different attitudes, a bunch of weird things going on with this company. Um, what's weird about it is I probably have more more knowledge and interaction of this company than most people on the internet. Because, uh, yeah, I have I have merch from them. I have swag from them. I have a bunch. I, I was searching my emails the other day, and guess what? I have all the emails I ever talked with them about. About contract negotiations, trip plans to go to E3, uh, what do you call them? Uh, like like uh, m money making opportunities. Uh, remember when uh, you know the incident happened and how they handled that and all that. I have it all. I literally have it all saved. So what I'm going to do <clears throat> is a special day long React event in July, probably mid to late July. And on that day, we're going to have a. Uh, I guess I don't know. We have to think about what we want to call it. Machinima's a, a machinima party, but it's not really a party because they're dead. So what do you <laughs> what do you call it? You're celebrating their death, We're the dancing dancing on the grave day or something. Like what do you call it? Funeral, the machinima funeral, but they've been dead for years. It's a little late for a funeral. But anyway, what I will do is I will react live to the June the King documentary, but I'll also be adding all this other supplemental material to it, including showing you all these cool things that I have, talking you know about the, the, the stories from the emails and things. So it's going to be a, a, a lengthy event with tons of, of stuff. Uh, if anything, it's going to be a very in-depth coverage of Machinima, maybe one of the most in-depth ones ever on the internet, because no one really covered it. You know, June the King's really the first person to cover it in depth at all. So, <clears throat> the posthumous, posthumous Posthumous party? The Machinima Posthumous Party. All right. Well, let's, let's start thinking of a name for this. We have to think of a name for this special event in mid to late July. Because early July will be the DSP, DSP. And then late July we'll have this other special event. Okay? It should be pretty fun. So let's figure that out. And then the next major event I'm doing is actually my anniversary celebration. For those who don't know... I've been an internet content creator now for 15 years. It all started September 2008. I still remember.